there is a big moment that did happen today. The jury watched a, this is actually, this gets me. I, I want to talk about this because I am deeply disturbed by this issue. It's a 2013 deposition. It is of the former Gawker editor, A.J. Delario, I think I'm pronouncing his name right, who had published portions of the sex tape. And this guy has asked some questions that I I'm shocked by his answers. Take a look. Imagine a situation where celebrity sex tape would not be his work. Uh, if they were a child. Underway. Four. So packed into that statement is a that a five-year-old being sexually abused, he would he would put out there. If they're a celebrity. If if, if yeah. it's of interest to the public, and B. There's no limit to anyone's privacy if there's a preoccupation in the public as he sees it, and then he puts it, he hides it under the First Amendment. Yeah. That's disgusting. See, I think he was the best witness for Hulk Hogan yes. in this case. I think he turned the jury totally sympathetic to Did Hulk he? Hogan and saying that, look, I would put any, I didn't care that this hurt he, uh, Hulk Hogan, I didn't care to embarrass him, I'm going to put it out there because I think people want to look at it because I liked looking at it and I thought it was funny and so I think everybody else should. I think at that funny. point people are going, that's what he said. Funny. Yeah, and he said, and I think that people are going to say, you know what, yes, Hulk Hogan is a public person, but there has to be a line when you're talking about somebody's bedroom, when you're talking about the actual act of sex, you can talk about about things, but that's not saying that he's consenting yeah, for people to come into his bedroom. Lonnie, you need and see listen, all of this. Spirit, help me with this because it's not even just people that talk about it. There's lots of people on the internet these days that put pictures of themselves out there. If those people that are in pornography want to have privacy, I don't care how preoccupied the public is with them, that idiot right. doesn't have the right to, right. to hide under the First Amendment right. and put their private moments, whatever they might be, out in the public. Thank you, Dr. Drew. And that's what this $100 million is really about. It is about sending a message that people are tired of being violated. Because I'm an entertainer means I get paid to entertain you when I say so, when we enter into an agreement. It doesn't mean everything about my life is open. This guy is depraved. I'm, I'm sorry, I don't know him, but that was under oath. That is a depraved statement, in my humble opinion, as a professional.